I know you're saying, what in the world is Tom Brown on my screen talking about now? Well, I'm going to tell you. Uh, we're having a big gala coming up October 21st. Your boy is turning 50. Yeah, 50 years old. So we thought it would be a great time to have a celebration for all the success we've had. As you know, we've had many uh, program successes over the years, but I'm going to talk to you about a couple of them that I think are pretty darn special. Uh, L-O-V-E, which is Lift Our Values Every Day is our youth piece. It's a piece that we've been able to help young people have career, career exploratory experiences, uh, be able to have trips and, and, and being able to broaden their horizons and have great mentorship experience with positive adults and just have an impact on children that otherwise may get underexposed to all the great things about our world, about our country, and about life experience in general. We've been working almost exclusively in D.C., but now we're expanding to the metro area. In Prince George's County, we have a lot of great programming and train grounds to work is another one that we think are just vital. Right now, a lot of people are looking for a second chance or looking for a new start in the career path and opportunities to be able to learn and get certification and training in areas that enable them to be self-sustaining. The training grounds presented an opportunity for me to attend Prince George's Community College to continue my education. Um, I passed my certification exam and then I was referred by the teacher before me to um, take over the class and assume her position. So now I'm currently the IT um, instructor at the school. Training ground brought to my life hope, <laughs> stability. But I thank God for training ground. Because listen to what it says training. I'm in training. And I'm so grateful that uh, we have uh, co event chairs. Lou Dubin, the Red Brick LMD, and Vance Gregg from Gregg Hodona Partners. Our gala, October 21st, coming up 6 p.m. at the ARC. This is going to be a fundraiser for Training Ground, so I'm asking you to purchase a ticket. I'm asking my corporate friends to, to bring sponsorship support. But really, it's all about just us getting together as a community, as a people, and celebrating a very positive organization. I've been the founder and executive director of Training Rounds for almost 12 years, and I'm so proud of the work that we've been able to do. So we have musical guests, Brian Lanier, and Kenny Allen will come out and blow your socks off. Remember summers at the swimming pool, where we swam all day till our skin Spending all our money on the ice cream truck. My man Sugar Bear, ow, ow. Come with James Funk, you know what it is with proper utensils. Put your Gucci watch on, synchronize your time, and let's go. We have special awards that we give out every year, Human Servant Awards. And this year, 2016, we have some very special award recipients that we're proud to present to you. First, we have the County Executive for Prince George's County, Mr. Mershon L. Baker III. In addition, we have Wanda Lockridge, who's the chair of the William O. Lockridge Foundation. Last but not least, the Deputy Mayor for Greater Economic Opportunity, none other than Ms. Courtney Snowden. And we ask you to help us transform neighborhoods one person at a time. I look forward to seeing you come out the website, www.traininggroundsdmv.org. But I need your support, family, and I'm asking you to come on board. Thank you. <laughs>